Hey friends, happy Monday. I put on like, I just took a shower and I feel really nice. I put on this like cropped, uh, what do you call it? Cropped sports bra, bralette thing. And it's so cozy. So this morning, I talked to my favorite person for a long time this morning and how oh, is so windy here <laughs> and after my favorite person this morning and it felt yeah it felt like home i don't know if that sounds too much but it felt like home and it felt right and it felt perfect and then it's my safe space like it's my safe space and i don't have that with anybody else and it's a place where like you can just spell out your emotions. You can spell out your feelings and like send me the really long messages about like how you're feeling and vice versa. And like there were a couple times where we were on the same page and that was beautiful. The last few weeks I've had lots of emotions and I think I felt the first time, I think I felt lonely one night and I kind of, I kind of dealt with that loneliness, I think, in the wrong way. <laughs> um, but I dealt with it, and it helped a little, but the thing I should have done, which was hug, use, well, which was um, watch my hug videos, and it just didn't feel right at that moment, which... It's crazy and lame, but that's how I felt. But the way I did deal with it, it was talking to some new friends and it felt weird, to be honest. And I'm just gonna be honest on here, it felt weird. So it's my first time ever really feeling lonely and now I know what that feels like and it's not a fun feeling, but it happens. I also sent a bunch of my emotions and feelings tonight in some more messages to my person and I just I can't thank them enough they're amazing and beautiful and just perfect but I can't thank them enough, enough for like being patient with me and dealing is that even a word I should use dealing with all of my long messages and my emotions and I have a lot of emotions and I feel like I express them, I don't even know, way more than I need to. <laughs> but that's just how I deal with things and you know we all deal with things differently and that's how I deal with it and I need to be okay with just sending them over and not like oh I'm gonna bother you or like this isn't important but if it's important to me it's important to them and I just love that and vice versa. Also. This morning, I I had a really great morning with my nephews, but then I came up here and I don't know why I'm like staring out, out the window and not looking at the camera, but I am. So I came upstairs and put on my playlist, which was, also I love my smiley face case from Wally Case. I put on my throwbacks playlist which i'll put the link down below actually it's on my spotify and my spotify links down below and just like danced majorly danced and it felt really good i also danced like in my bra and my underwear and looked in my mirror and was like i fucking love you katie and i like saw my whole body i saw my tummy i saw everything and just was like dancing and at that moment I had complete love and proudness of my whole body and it was beautiful and it was what I need it was what I needed and then I went out to one of my favorite places and had more me time and then I was sitting there and someone had walked in and it was really awkward 
someone from my past and it was really awkward I don't know if they saw me but I was kind of like looking at my phone because I was adding music to my playlist and drinking my tea and then I and then they walked in and it was like okay that's awkward anywho yeah um <laughs> I hope you all had a great Monday I've had those emotions in me I feel like when I say these things I'm rambling on too much too much but when I have those feelings and thoughts I've had them in my head for so long and I haven't I've kept them to myself because I didn't know if anyone really wanted to listen or if that person and if I just I'm not good at expressing my emotions I'm not good at like sending my emotions over and I need to get better at that but I also need to get better at controlling them myself and seeing if I can handle it myself which I'm an overthinker and so it's not easy <laughs> anywho I hope that y'all have a great night if you're asleep I hope you wake up to beautiful Tuesday I'm gonna go make my dinner and watch a movie I watched Grateful Noise last night which is a really good movie and it's all about music and it was really fun and I had tons of buttercup cuddles But I'm going to send those messages over to my favorite person and I, yeah, I feel like I could, could say more about that, but I'm not going to ramble on about it because I don't need to. And anyway, thank you for watching and subscribing and liking whatever you do. I appreciate you. I'm really super proud of this channel and I'm really proud of where it's going, you know, what I'm doing with it and all of the above. So thank you and Katie, you're amazing and beautiful and perfect. I love your smile. I love you being you and you know what? Don't feel ashamed, Katie, to share those emotions. Don't keep them inside of you unless you really want to. Don't keep them inside of you. Just the right people want to hear. And I know it's hard for you. I know it's hard to share those. I know it's hard to express those feelings. But do it. As I said, the right people will want to know. The right people will always be there for you no matter what. And they want to make sure you're okay. So, there you go, Katie. And don't forget that you're amazing and beautiful and perfect. And I'll see you all in my next Confident Katie video. As I said, maybe this week I might go live sometime. We'll see, but I hope you all have a great night and I'll see you in the next video.